Yo, what's going on everybody? It's your boy iPod King Carter here. Your boy just woke up and the news is already booming, bruh. Right now, I'm bringing you guys a video from the homie 3MG Live. And if you look at the title in the top corner, it says NBA 2K18 lets you upload custom logos for clothes. This finna be a breeze. This finna be a fire video. I need you guys to go check out 3MG Live channel because he got some NBA 2K18 news booming right now. And that's why I'm reacting to it. Let's get into the video. Okay, I see you with the intro. Trying to get me a copyright, bruh. <laughs> All right, y'all. So, listen, this shit is huge fucking news. So, now I don't own this footage right here. I'm going to put the link in the description below to the original video. There's tons of fucking content in the mm. link in the description below to this gentleman. But shout out to him. I had to bring this part of the footage. Look, you're going to be able to now have custom t shirts. You could customize your own t shirts. I think you're able to throw like your custom images up on submissions so that people could go ahead and check them out. I'm not 100% sure. Hey guys, IKC crew, team IKC. Y'all ready to run it up with these custom logos? Listen, hey, come to my Discord right now, man. Discord.gg slash iPod King Carter if you're watching this video. If you want to support some crazy custom IKC gear, I'm talking about Bape IKC. I'm talking about Louis IKC, Gucci IKC. Ooh. We about to be hype beasts all year, bruh. Hey, let's get, you know what? Let's keep going, dog. Let's go. This, mm, look, create a t-shirt, t-shirt voting, buy a t-shirt that's approved in, by the 2K community. If you're able to sell them for VC, but I do know that people can go ahead, surf out images on through the 2K storefront and see a whole bunch of them. For example, in the footage you see that somebody uses LeVar Ball. This is big news. The reason why is because this always been here for WW2K. You was always able to add images even for tattoos, Facts. which I hope they can do this shit one day with 2K if they haven't already brought it in this one. As well as in the Pro-Am, you was able to add images to your court. The reason why this is big is because you got people like the Pretty Boy Fredos, where you have their fan bases so so huge. You got the Savage Squad Hoopers, I think, if I'm not mistaken. You got the Flight. Believe it or not, Flight still has a large fan base. If he wanted to start up an FTC squad, he can make t-shirts. Flight team stand. <laughs> yo listen quick yo quick story about flight yo we was playing um basketball at the 2k event right and a loose ball situation happened now i tell people about flight all the time dog flight got hustle flight got a crazy first step i'm telling you if flight had control bro he'd be one of the top 2k youtubers in basketball dog but check this out flight went for a loose ball right and almost killed himself, guys. When when flight see a loose ball, yo, his eye is on a prize, yo. It was a, a fold up table, a bunch of roller and fold up chairs, like in the vicinity where flight wanted to go die for the loose ball, and he almost killed himself, guys. He fell on top of the the fold up table, but like. I don't know how he caught himself, but he legit started break dancing on the table. Like you guys know when you break dance and you like get on the ground and you like use your hands on the ground, but you like start kicking your feet in the air. That's how flight did dog. And he spun and like, yo, we was like, yo, he was like, yo dog, I'm good. I'm good. Yo, it was hilarious dog. But let's get back to the video. Shirts on here and all his FTC fans can go ahead and rock that fucking shirt. This is big if you want to grind out with your teammates and you really want to show who's in your squad. You could just jump into the playground or the park, however they're calling it, and you can go ahead and roam around and have your own custom logos and your custom shit. This is fucking lit. You don't understand how long <laughs> I've been waiting for this type of shit. All right, now what you see, guys, is you're at the tattoo studio. Now remember, you're getting inked up, which means this is what you can do in 2K. It's not just a menu where you pick a tattoo. You actually go to a tattoo parlor. I don't and get know if inked they up. added this also for t tattoos because I don't know if they want to make it inappropriate. I know they go in E League. I don't know how far. All right, and you can choose where you want the tattoo to go. And as you guys can see, this sp specific tattoo that he's choosing won't let you go to the chest, the back, or the neck. They're taking that. But this shit is huge. Now, the way this also works is sort of like a catch. Um, You're able to cap. You can only level up your mob player to 80, 85. So All right, guys. Big thing. Max out VC 85. All right. I, I told you guys this many a times. If you're buying VC and you want to max your player out without doing anything else, you can get to a level 85. All right. But that don't mean you can get a skateboard yet. 
You can't get a skateboard yet. All that other grinding with VC, by the way, let me make that clear. You're only able to level up your character up to 85 with VC. After that, all the extra shit is grinding, right? So all the VC you will be earning in game, you could use that now to purchase the custom t-shirt. And from what I saw here was like around 5,000 VC. It's really not that bad because you'll be playing so many fucking park, um, park games that you're gonna earn that VC regardless. Another dope thing about this shit too is that they got mini modes, mini games in this shit. So there's always ways to earn VC. This custom t-shirt shit is fucking lit. You don't understand. You got people who's gonna wanna create all right guys now you notice when you put on a new hairstyle there's actually a little cut scene right there man a little a little good gta 5 feel i know it, it's hard for me not to mention gta 5 but i'm gonna let you guys know a little gem a lot of people gonna be like yo gta 5 helped 2k on this game gta 5 did not help NBA 2K18 on any of their development during this making of the game. I have it from actual sources from Rockstar Games camp that said they did not help them. 2K is in San Francisco, Nevada. Rockstar is in NY. I was just at Rockstar yesterday. You guys see me stream live on their live stream website. Rockstar did not help 2K. A lot of people can say they influenced them though. They gave them a great idea though. I mean, this is lit. Let's keep going, man. Like a little squad called Louis Boys and just create Louis Vuitton designs. You're gonna have the fucking bait motherfuckers out there. You're gonna have a whole bunch of crazy trendy ass shit going on. OVO, all these name brands that exist, you're gonna see this shit. You're gonna have Rock Nation. Yo, I'm telling you, people are gonna get very creative with this shit and really design some dope ass gears for their teammates, for their squad members, for, for the fans. All right, guys, you see the got next spot on the little uh pick em up hoop joint. You know what I'm saying? So so remember guys, the Got Next spot has not been taken away from the game. Got Next is still in the game, okay? For people to really search over in the 2K like little storefront and really try to like download their images. This shit is fucking huge news. You guys don't understand how big this shit is. This guy, I don't know. Hold up. What was it? What was that question, bro? This shit is fucking huge news. You guys All right, who won the most NBA most improved player award for 2014-2015 season? Most improved player, uh, would that be, I think that might be Jimmy Butler. Because Draymond Green was already nice. DeAndre Jordan, they wouldn't give him most improved because he hasn't really done that crazy. Kawhi Leonard was already, like, known. I mean, I don't understand the how big is. this shit is. This guy, I don't know his, um, I think he just showed us. Jimmy Butler. Yo, I'm not. Yo, I'm telling you guys, man. If you guys miss my vlog about me going to go play 2K early on uh, PS4 and Nintendo Switch, when we went to the music studio, Damian Lillard had trivia, and I won trivia uh, headphones, dog. I'm nice with the trivia. Stop playing with me, yo. I'm, I'm really. I'm telling y'all, I'm really nice with the trivia, man. I really do this, man. Hey, Jimmy. Hey, everybody, hit up Jimmy Butler on Twitter and tell him I got one of his answers right from trivia, dog. He got to send me something, yo. You know what I'm saying, follow me back or something. It's like a demo take of his customization, but it's just it's still one of the most improved player awards in nine to that intense season. Uh, not D Rose, definitely. Um, Brandon Roy, no. Aaron Brooks, ooh. Darren Williams. Nah, Darren Williams was just about to go to. Ooh, that Shows was hard. Some detail as to I'm gonna say, I'm gonna say B or D. Like that. I'm gonna say B or D though. But I'm telling you right now, yo. D Aaron Brooks, see? Yo, I'm nice, bro. Because I remember Darren Williams was like on his way to another team or something like that or wasn't doing too good. Like he was on a major decline. And Aaron Brooks, I think this is when he had went to that one team and was like snapping, shooting crazy deep threes and stuff like that. Was it, I don't know if it was the Rockets or what, but I know it was a, sp a specific team he went to and he just started spazzing. The fucking possibilities. The, the My player appearance, look at his DNA background. The fucking variety is endless, yo. I'm telling you right now, I could see a whole fucking park lobby full of like SSH or fucking FTC or Nasty Crew or IKC. I could see a bunch. Hey, IKC crew, team IKC, what we going to be doing? Um, yo, listen, let me know what y'all want to do, man. 
I'm trying to tell y'all we could get it lit, man. Join my Discord. I ain't playing with y'all. Bunch of that shit, man. This shit's gonna be fucking lit. Y'all don't understand how big this shit's gonna end up being, man. So let me know what you guys think about this below. If you see this footage here, they also got different haircut designs. They're showing also the tattoos, the 2K zone. I believe there's gonna be so many other different like stores to go into in this shit, but this shit is fucking amazing. I think you get to customize jackets, t-shirts, tank tops. I hope you can customize like, you know, hats as well. Really go to the T with the gear, man. This shit would be fucking lit as shit. This All right, also guys, if you check it out when it say new design, rookie designer, I'm guessing as you level up, you get more t-shirts and more types of tees to actually uh design yourself so just make sure keep leveling up in the game man you gotta level up in 2k bro this is gonna also be good for the e-league version because you know the e-league thing is gonna grow with 2k so i think this is definitely a great concept and a great fucking idea but drop your comments below it's your boy 3g make sure you guys subscribe like follow me on all social media platforms and until then i'll see you next time peace all right, guys. One little thing before we get get like, up out of here. On social media platforms. Um, let me see. Next time. All right, guys. If you notice, Foot Locker it says on court, street slash park. So right now it's only it's only say page one of one. I know a lot of people probably like, bro. What you mean, like, what well, like on court? What you mean, street? What you mean? So on court is probably going to be pro am. Uh, of course the NBA games and. A street slash park is when you're playing at the playground and when you're walking through the streets in the city and the neighborhood and all that. So, you know what I'm saying? Just Peace. make sure you guys oh, yeah. choose what you want to choose and everything like that, man. Make sure you guys know what you want when you get to the park. When the prelude come out, guys, I made a video about the prelude, but I will say it right here in this video instead of having you guys go over to that video. Matter of fact, should I make you guys go over to that video? I don't know. But make sure you guys check out the prelude. Playing offline against the CPU at the playground park, whatever you want to call it. This is IKC signing out. Make sure you guys subscribe. I'm going to highlight you guys in the next one, all right? Peace. Oh, and don't forget, check out 3MG. He got that heat on his channel. It's lit. Case money. <laughs>